Greetings out to these and Guardians, my name is Hyper Himes. This is not usually how I do these videos. In fact, usually if I were to do a video like this, it would actually be on your local pleb because I've done videos like this before. Except, well, first of all, this is on my new desk. And also, I usually don't... I, I, I guess I've done unboxing videos before, usually with my reaction. However, I kind of want to do it in a way where you just get to view a whole entire desk downward angle, if that makes sense. Before you say, yes, this mouse pad is old. It's not even a mouse pad, it's a Pokemon trading card game playing mat. But it works literally as a mouse pad, so shh, it's okay. You may have read the title saying like, oh, Dev Sisters gave me something really cool, or Dev Sisters gave me something, which that is true. You may be wondering, how did this happen? Right when Witch's Castle got released, I was contacted by Dev Sisters saying, hey, guess what, we're gonna be doing this cool little collaboration thing, where, you know what, we want you to be a part of it. And I'm just like, okay, well, how does this work? Well, and they were just like, oh, just play the game and that's it. And I'm just like, okay, cool. I'm not sure if this counts as a sponsor or anything, but fun fact, they were even like, hey, if you do this, we're gonna go ahead and give you some goodies. And I'm just like, what, what do you mean by goodies? This is what they meant by goodies. You want full perspective on how this box looks? Look how big this, this is my hand right here. This is how big my hand is. The box is probably the size of like six of my hands. That's how big it is. Yeah, so as far as I remember, this is because they're celebrating uh, Kikurun Witch's Castle recently being released. And they were like, hey, we'll give you some free goodies for this. And I'm just like, you know what? Why not? So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be opening this together. Which every, everything's censored right here. Shh, don't worry. As you can see right here, it straight up just says Witch's Castle. And it even got stamped. This was apparently sent by... Uh, I think, is that, is that a cheese bird? Oh, I get it. That's the mole. Because, like, they have this, like, mole shipping center that's uh, available. I know it's badly out of focus, but that's because I'm trying to bring it up to the camera. In Witch's Castle, there's, like, this mole shipping service. Which, it's just something in the game. It's, it's something Kick Run related, you know? So, with all that being said, I'm pretty sure it's about time that we crack open this box. Because I'm about to show you everything that you can get inside of here. Because I'm pretty sure this is available on the Kick Run shop. So, if you do want to buy this for yourself, you can. Just we need to save up a little bit of money though. Scissors are safe to open this, right? Like, I'm, I'm not gonna get demonetized. Gotta be careful with this. My whole entire career depends on it. There we go. That's another side down. I probably can just rip this open. And... Alright, I'm getting a knife, but I'm not gonna show it because I'm gonna get my channel banned if that's the case. YouTube's so sensitive. I swear people use this for cement. Oh my gosh. Everything's literally shaking. That's how, like, rambunctious this was. But finally, after, like, five hours, we could probably see what's inside this thing for finally once. I already see something in here that I enjoy. I'm really happy for what I'm seeing here. Oh, it's time for the grand reveal. It's time to open up the treasures. Oh, my. Look, look, look at that. Look at him. Look at him. First of all, you got some great bubble wrap. That's pretty good. Next. The sweetie. Look. Oh, it's, he's here. He's here. He's so big. I thought he'd be like a little bit small. I thought he'd be like the size of my hand. Like that's basically the size of like the normal gingerbread plush. But no, this is the ginger dozer plushie, which just look at him. He looks so sweet. I, I, I'm going to take him out of the bag just so you can get a closer look. Don't worry. I must unleash you from your prison. Oh my, he feels so soft. Oh my gosh, he feels so soft. He feels like the sweetest little marshmallow ever. Oh my, they are just the most adorable little thing. Just look at, look, he's so sleepy eepy. He got the, this is Ginger Do- Oh, I think there's a, there's a, first of all, he's got the hat. The yellow, like, knob on top, which is nice. It feels like a nice bunny cotton ball. Uh, there's the stars on it. Uh, if you want to, you can take a hat off. Like, I like how you can kind of see how one of his eyebrows is actually hidden, but you pick it up. It's just right there. Oh, just like a little, like, snooze, snot dribble. Uh, he looks like, hey, hello, just waving hands. And you can also see the tags right here, which it's kind of hard to see. But as you can see, if you look close, you have the green candy cane, which that is Dozer's candy cane. And then you have a little extra tag for Kick Your Run Witch's Castle right here, which I think the rest of the back of this stuff is just informational stuff, but... Oh, that's so cool! It's even hard to see, but there's an even smaller tag that I, it's really hard to see here. But it says Cookie Run, uh, which obviously it says uh, Dev Sisters Corp. Well, you know, obviously because Dev Sisters is the one that sent me this package. If this was the only thing that was in the box, I, I, I would not be mad at all. But there's more. There's actually more. This is the Cookie Run Witch's Castle art book. Look how thick this book is, and. There's also this, but we're gonna save this for last because I think it might be pretty neat. Oh, and this thing is securely protected because as you can see, it has like some extra set of plastic film. You can kind of hear it. There's like plastic film on it that's also protecting it. This did indeed come all the way from Korea. Literally, I had to wait a few extra days because I had some shipping issues with it, but 
I made it get here. Now, I'm not going to pry too much into the book. However, I will take this box out of the way just so we can actually get a little bit of a glander into it. Honestly, if you want the book, you got to definitely like get the stuff for yourself because it's pretty good. But this is awesome. This is genuinely cool. There's three guarantees you'll always encounter in life. Death, taxes, and plastic. Now, smoothly. Oh, that was good. That was good right there. You just sleep. It's a little baby. So we'll take a slight gander at the Art of the Cookie Run Witch's Castle book, but I'm not going to show too much because, like I mentioned, I'm not going to go ahead and spoil the whole entire book because, honestly, then how would Dev Sisters make money? What, what do you think they are, a pay-to-win company? They would never do that. So just opening up to the first page, we instantly see, oh, that's fun. There's nothing. <laughs> okay, so the real, real first page is, wait, 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 huh? Okay, so the real first page, it's, it's blue and purple. Okay, we're, we're, we're getting a little bit of a difference there. The real first, wait, is that? It's like a letter. Is this stuck on here? So this is like an invitation thing? Oh, what? What? To whom opened this book? I invite you to the witch's castle. Let me tell you the story of witch's castle. It's hard to see, but apparently it's inviting you inside. Like a, that's actually nice. I like this little self-made letter that you can just like fit back into yourself. Like, come on, that is cool. If I can refit it again, that, oh, this might be, oh, fix it. If we flip to the next page, we will see this whole line of thing. Whoa, whoa, wait, wait, what is this? Okay, so over here is lyrics to something? In a time when magic was forgot, bland desserts were all they got. A girl, a shadow in an ancient hold, with a secret recipe, a story untold. Sugar, salt, flour, yeast they found, in the sweet cream scent once unbound. The rusty oven awake from slumber deep, with memories the witched secrets keep. Mixing bacon cookies anew, in nameless witches' tales they grew. Under cold moonlight, the castle grand, freshly baked cookies warmed the land. Someday cookies may discover the way why the witches bake them night and day, but for now, now, remember this message I say, cookies run away from the witch, don't delay. So this just seems like the opening entrance, so I'll just go through a tiny bit more. Okay, so you have all the contents here. You have past and present, the witch's castle, cookies, residence, and more await. So I'm not going to show off too much like I mentioned, but we're just going to flip randomly to a page. How about that? Like, if we just open here, it's more of an opening thing, interesting, but we'll just flip on randomly, like right here. That, that's Dozer. That's Dozer right. Look, look at the, look at the friend. Look at the friend right here. It's hard to see the whole book. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. You see all of his little like crying, right? Like that's, oh my gosh, I just want to pick him up. And, hug. and you can see how much shorty he is in comparison to everyone else. So if we flip to another one, we do see, whoa, 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 what the heck? It's, what? Are you kidding? This is so cool. It's like, is this a witch's castle? Like stand up? Th no, no, it, it folds out. It folds out. Are you flooding? That's insanity. That's actually so cool. You can have this like little setup like somewhere in your room and you can have it like, I, I don't even know because like, it's like 3D, like it expands here. It even goes to the other side. It's double side. Oh my gosh, this is insane. Oh, this is so cool. Oh, I'm in love with this already. I'm so glad that I decided to open the book. We'll flip to one more, which, what is this? It's like a map layout? Interesting. Okay, let's end off with a banger. Let's see something good. It's a bigger map thing, which I see that bird friend right there, but also a lot more rooms, I guess, being filled. Okay, I think we dwelled too much into this art book. If you want to go ahead and try and get more of it, either buy the art book yourself, because I'm pretty sure the Kick Your Run Witch's Castle art book is available. It's just, you know, one of those things that you have to self-purchase, you know? I don't want to go ahead and spoil the whole entire book for you, but honestly, this is honestly really worth it if you want to go into some extra content and some extra showcase of stuff. I mean, combine that with this, and it's already basically, it, it, everything is worth gold. The very last thing that was inside this box is this thing which i don't know what it is but apparently i think it's an invitation yeah it does say witch's castle invitation which i don't know what makes this different from the one inside of the book but we'll give it a gander it easily peels open like that we reveal the content inside and it says on here without the these are how the how do witches deal with letters like these okay it just says here get ready for a fantastic blockbuster puzzle adventure you're invited to the cookie run witches castle launching showcase also it has a qr code there which i'm pretty sure links you directly to the castle showcase the witches castle showcase and telling you that it premieres on may 12th 2024 which it already happened by then, so it would be pretty unique if this was like a customized letter straight to, you know, content creators and stuff. But to be fair, the fact that I got sent this for free because Dev Sisters are like, hey, we'll pay attention to you. I'm really happy about that. So that's basically that. That's everything that you get. You get yourself the entirety of the art of Cookie Run Witch's Castle. You get yourself the sweet little dozer plus lights. Come on, how, how would you not want to trust this sweet little face? You get a little invitation card. I also want you to get the box to go with it as well. Honestly, I'll probably just save the box for some storage. But the fact that I got a little like nice custom invitation thing, which honestly, it's hard to say what's more exciting because I love 
the Dozer plushie. This Dozer plushie is so adorable. Also, the amount of content that's available in this art book is probably insane. I think it's more content than probably like the Kick Your Run Kingdom art book. And I don't even have that yet because the only time I spent money for that, I actually gifted it to someone else because they deserved it more than I did. But with that being said, I think I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. I basically showcased all I wanted to uh, see, show, all that stuff. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. I know it's a little bit different, but I really, really want to showcase this stuff. But with that being said, if you enjoyed the video, then please be sure to leave a like on it, and I'll share the video with your friends if you enjoy my kick around content. And if you enjoy my content in general, then why not subscribe, and also hit the bell icon to be notified of whatever I do in the future. Also, down below in the description, you'll see links to all my social media, including a Twitter post where if it gets 10,000 likes, I can get the kick around YouTube stuff for absolutely free, a link to my Discord server called the Hype Beast Hub, a link to my merchandise where you can buy stuff to represent the channel, and lastly, a link to my Ko-fi where for just $1 a month, you can see exclusive content that you wouldn't normally see on this normal YouTube channel. But above all else, I will see you entities and guardians in the next video. Hail the hype news.